Hi guys, Soul Intuition here. I know I just made a video the other day, um, but I will be posting a lot of videos here on out because I it's, it's just a daily assignment for me. It's something that I really want to get used to doing, and um, I don't know. I just feel like I need, I need to do it. So I hope you guys don't feel like I'm bombarding you with videos, and I hope you enjoy them. They're going to be on various topics. But um, today's topic is actually how to deal with frustration in life and impatience or being patient. The reason why I'm making this video is I had like a rough weekend, motivationally speaking. I just, I don't know, I just didn't feel that. Ugh, like you guys check my videos out you know I'm talking to my subscribers and if you haven't subscribed please hit subscribe right now thank you and also give me a thumb up right now I'll wait thank you <laughs> but um for those of you who have been following me for you know the last few months you know I'm usually upbeat and um really optimistic and lately I just I don't know. I was on Twitter just tweeting about how, you know, there's so many negative people around me and it seems like they're doing better than I'm doing. I try to be as positive as possible. I work hard. You know, I got so many goals that I'm trying to reach and it just seems like nothing is coming together for me. And, um, you know, I was just all down in the mouth about myself and what I've been doing. I've been trying to do so much, and I think I just overwhelmed myself, you know, looking for results, um, quick results. And some, some of the results have been coming, you know. It's, it's, it's been steady, but I just wanted what I wanted at the time. I felt like I needed to have it. See, but now this is Monday, and I was feeling this way Saturday, Friday and Saturday, and some events transpired over the weekend, and I just realized everything is okay. You know, the seeds that I'm planting right now will grow, but it takes time, and you know, the burden is called patience. That's my burden to bear. I know um, it's not easy being patient, especially when you're working hard, you know, and you, you know you're working hard and so you want to see results. It's not like I'm just sitting back being lazy. I'm actually putting work. I'm putting effort. I'm putting mental energy toward achieving my goals. And um, I just feel like people are getting there quicker than I am. And I'm trying to do things the right way. And you know how it is. It seems like when you're doing something the right way, it takes forever. And you see people around you. Um, they're doing things not so correct, you know, not not such in the right way. And it seems like they're just getting things thrown at them, you know. And um, today, though, I said, first of all, a way to get over this is to pace myself. I need to pace myself. Give myself two maybe three things to do a day, you know, and, and, and get those done and not try to do so much at, at one time, which is what I've been doing, you know, like I'll do a blog post, and, and you guys don't know this, but I have like five blogs, and um, a couple of them I've had for, well, one I've had for a few years, um, it's called Or Hardly Working. And then I have, I mean, my dating blog, which mostly is videos now. But um, then I have my review blog where I review products. Then I have my internet businesses that I'm doing. And I try to do all of it, contribute to all of them every night. And that is not working. I'm going to burn myself out. I've realized that. So I can't do that. I have to give myself goals and meet them, you know, one at a time. Give myself realistically achievable goals so this video is just a lesson to myself but I wanted to share that with you because maybe you're going through the same thing and just to know hey you can do it all but you have to give yourself time to do it and don't put too much on yourself do what you can 
in a reasonable amount of time. I was staying up to 1, 2, sometimes 3 o'clock in the morning because I work a day job. You guys know that. Um, I work a day job, so once I get home from work, you know, I make dinner for my son. Um, while he's doing homework, I'm doing my work. But then I end up staying up after he goes to bed, and then I'm up. And then I'm up in the morning, you know, getting him up, ready for school, and then going to work. And I just keep repeating this cycle. And I was doing it for a few weeks, and it's just, I realized that if I keep doing that, I'm going to burn myself out, and I won't end up doing anything. And that will be uh, totally counterproductive. So I want to share my experience with you so you can learn from my trials or whatever mistakes if you you know what have you um so yeah what I've learned is not to put so much on myself I'm just ambitious and there's so many things that I want to do and I got so many goals that I want to reach and sometimes I just feel like there's not enough time in a day to do it all and I'm the type of person if I'm not doing something I'm feeling guilty so sometimes I can't even enjoy my rest because okay so yesterday was Sunday and I said well, I had goals to write some blog posts, and um, early in the day, I decided not to. I was not going to do any work, no work, not even reading, because what I do is um, I, I, I do a little bit of education every day, um, learning about Internet marketing and having a business online. I, I read, I watch videos, um, I'm taking a seminar, but it's a self-paced course. So I'll do that, and then I'll implement some things that I learned. And uh, but I need to just I just decided to allot myself time, you know, two hours, maybe three. Um, so like I said, Sunday I said no, I'm taking Sunday completely off. Today is Veterans Day too. Yesterday was the Marine Corps birthday, which is my birthday too because I'm a Marine and. Veterans Day today, so I said, you know what, I'm going to take off. So Sunday, I did nothing. I watched movies, and I watched um, Law and Order, okay, and I enjoyed my time off. So today, being Monday, I did have to go to work, and then I came home, watched a little TV, um, and then I started educating myself. So anyway, I am going to do a little bit of work. I did write a blog today for my Or Hardly Working blog. Y'all can check that out. It's orhardlyworking.blogspot.com. It's pretty funny. Um, it's not as funny as it used to be. We're, I'm getting a little more serious, but I'm going to get back to the funny post. All right. Uh, this message is getting way long, and I'm tired. And guess what? I still got a little bit of work to do, but I promise I won't be up till 1 o'clock in the morning today. I've given myself a curfew of... Midnight. I gotta be in bed by midnight. So that's it, guys. If you're getting frustrated or you got so many goals, and you're trying to do everything. Just the moral of this video is: pace yourself. The rewards are coming. You just keep digging at it and don't overdo it. Just don't overburden yourself, and you'll be just fine. All right, guys. Um, make sure you like, subscribe, and please share. I do appreciate it. Leave a comment below if you're going through similar things or you have and what lessons that you've learned. I'd love to hear from you. And um, we'll talk soon. Peace.